welcome to the Glen Tree Academy student and this is Dr. Vaishnavi here and I'm going to teach you yoga for beginners okay okay uh, so I'm just going to first teach you how to stand in correct posture so try to bring the feet together heels together knees straight pelvic straight shoulders back and hands just next to your body and relax your face give a beautiful smile and let's begin our class today okay so let's just take a deep inhale exhale one more deep inhale exhale let's take one more deep inhale exhale and now we are going to turn our palms outside and let's go to slowly try with a deep inhale raise your arms up raise your heels up and let's balance on the tip of your toes and bring your palms together and let's stay there 10 let's balance 9 and keep breathing 8 7 balance on your toes 6 5 4 3 2 1 and turn your palms down and let's slowly come down Let's do our second posture, which is called tree posture. Okay, so you have to balance well. So take the right leg, place it over onto the top. Let's take the hands up, and we exactly look like a beautiful tree with the branches and stay still. Now try to balance and stay there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one and slowly bring it down let's do the other side leg down take the other leg and try to keep the leg a little bit higher okay but you can go here here or here absolutely okay as long as you're balancing and hold still take a nice deep take your hands around join your palms together and stay still you know how the tree stands still so just stay still like a tree and six and five four three two one and slowly bring your palms down and legs down and let's relax breathe in and breathe out now we're just going to turn to the side and i'm just going to raise my arms up inhale look at the sky beautiful exhale reach forward okay let's do once more stretch your body open up your arms nicely inhale stretch back as much as you can exhale reach forward and now this time slowly bring your hands up and we're going to go in something called squatting like you're sitting on a chair so you bring your palms together in front hold it down and push and visualize there's a beautiful chair behind you and you sit on the chair and raise your arms up and stay there six five four three two one and slowly come up get up from the chair and bring the palms down okay inhale exit and now next one we have something called garudasana which is the eagle posture so which is might be slightly difficult but we are going to try so we take the right leg cross it over the left leg and join your palms and let's try let's try i know it's difficult to balance but let's give it a shot six five four three two one and down so yoga helps you to balance the body at the same time the balance helps you to improve your concentration improve your mind and stay still five four three two one and release this is called eagle posture so lots of the asanas are named after lots of animals okay so we are going to do lots of those postures today so be with me and let's go so now spread your legs as wide as you can i know you have nice nice long legs so just spread your nice long legs inhale raise your arms up exhale let's go forward 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 and place both the palms pressing it down and stretch the body enjoy now i'm going to press my right hand and twist and look at the sky and look at my hand and stay there Six, five, four, three, two, one, and. 
and slowly come down and shift to the other side and see. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and down, inhale, exhale, come back, palms down, and go. Now let's bring the legs together. Inhale and exhale. Let's do some balancing posture. So are you with me here? And let's go. So I come at the back of the mat and I take my right leg forward. Now we are going into something called warrior. You have heard of a warrior pose? So we are going to do warrior one, warrior two, and warrior three together. So we take the right leg forward, back leg is nicely 45 degrees, and I inhale and I stretch and I go up. This is a strong warrior and stay looking tall and beautiful, very strong. Five and four, three and two and one. And then I turn around looking beautiful, tall and strong and stay. So this leg goes in right angle, 90 degrees, back leg is straight and stay there. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and then drop your right hand behind the right feet and let's look up and stay. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring the left hand down and let's lift the right hand up and twist. And six, five, four. Three, two, one, and slowly come back, up, and stay. We're going to do with the left side. We always do the right side and the left side in yoga. So we take the left leg back. Nicely big step. Inhale. Now remember the right angle in your front knee. Inhale, raise, and stay. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, and I turn, and I fold. Eight, seven, six, be strong. Five, four, three, two, and then I take my left hand and place it behind my left, and look up. And stay there. Four, three, two, one, and I'll bring my opposite hand and go for my twist, and look up. Six. Five, four, three, two, one, and down, and bring the leg and come back into the center. We're going to try something called balance with the, like an aeroplane. So bring both the feet together, keep the spine straight, inhale, exhale, and let's go up, 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 and let's try to balance, look down, and stay there. Five, four, Three, two, one, and come back. So you look like an aeroplane with two wings. Let's go another side, and down, and down, and steady, and hold. Five, four, three, two, one, and down. Inhale, exhale. So this is for your leg work, and let's get it. Now next one, we are going to go for something called sun salutation. So we're going to try. Let's come in front of the mat. Look at the beautiful sun rays falling on your face. Give a beautiful, nice smile. Take a deep inhale. Bring both the palms together in front of your chest. Stand still. Breathe in and breathe out. Inhale. Raise your arms up and look up. Exhale. Inhale right leg back okay exhale take the other leg back and we go into something called other mukha you can call it like your body looks like a beautiful mountain and the head inside and stay there five four three two one and now slowly bring the body straight and we're going to drop the knees drop the chest inhale come up beautifully Exhale, go back. Inhale, bring the right leg forward. Exhale, other leg forward. Backward and palms together. Let's do the left side. Inhale, backward bend. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, left leg back. Exhale, other leg back. 
and now open your arms go into a deeper big mountain and here i just want you to press your right knee in press your left knee in it's like you're wiggling up wiggling down four and three two and one and up slowly down now take the full body down inhale exhale inhale come up exhale bring the left leg forward between the palms bring the other leg forward backwards and palms together in few classes i'm going to teach you how to jump into ashtanga let's do the round two inhale exhale inhale right leg back exhale other leg back now from here lift the right leg up so remember we have your third leg onto the top breathe in breathe out and stay there five four three two one bend the leg bring it in the front okay and now i'm going to drop my back knee down push this knee forward and we are going to something called crescent moon we look like the half crescent moon and stretch back and stretch beautifully five four three two one down take the leg back let's complete the chaturanga inhale exhale inhale right leg exhale other leg inhale backwards exhale palms back let's do the left side inhale exhale inhale left leg exhale other leg and now we are going to lift the other leg up nicely stretch point your toes push your head inside and stay 5 4 3 2 1 and let's bring the leg forward now let's drop the back knee onto the floor take it up let's go into a crescent moon and stay raise and stay there 6 5 4 3 2 1 and down take it toes in take the leg back drop your body down if you can go full it's okay or just drop the full body down inhale look up exhale back inhale left leg exhale other leg inhale backwards exhale palms together are you with me kids we are going for round 3 palms together inhale backwards exhale forward inhale exhale now we're going to try something called yoga push ups okay let's see how strong we are so you take the right leg up bring it place it next to the right palm keep the body up and i just want you to go down and up go down and up go down and up once more go down and up go down and up take the leg back inhale exhale drop the knees down drop the chest down inhale look up exhale inhale right leg exhale other leg inhale backwards exhale palms together take a nice deep inhale and exhale we are going to go for the left side inhale exhale inhale left leg exhale and now let's take the left leg up bring it so your feet and your hand should be in one straight line back leg up and let's go down and up let's go down and up 3 2 1 and down bring the legs back go for a nice chaturanga so chaturanga is four angas so we go down on our feet and hands and go down inhale look up exhale inhale left leg exhale other leg inhale exhale and palms together and relax yes did you have fun did you like sun salutation so this is a sun salutation we just did three rounds today and we are just going to lie down onto the mat and maybe take few breath and relax and just open your legs 
Open your palms and relax, close your eyes and stay there. Breathe in and breathe out. Inhale and exhale. Try to be as calm as possible. And now we are going to go into your boat posture. So I'm going to teach you how to simplify and enter into a boat posture. Okay? So boat posture is something like this. We look like the body looks like a boat. So I'm going to teach you how to go there. So what you do is first, you bend the knees. Okay? And then you come up. So you know how to sit like this, right? Then put your hands behind your knees and look straight up. Take the right leg up. Take the left leg up. And then release the hands. And there you are into your boat portion. Control there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Drop the knees down. And there we are. Inhale, exhale, and relax. Breathe in. And next we are going to go into some other animal. You are going to go something called fish pose. Okay? Which is very easy and simple. So what do you do is, now why is it called fish? When you look at the posture, your body looks like a fish, a beautiful fish. So you sit with the legs folded or legs straight. You can sit whichever way you want. But since you are very flexible, so you can do it. Bend, go back. Hands down. First drop your elbows down. Keep it next to your feet. And drop, look behind. Inhale, exhale and stretch your arms and stay there. 10, 9, so your chest goes up, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, come back, roll up, come onto your elbows and come into straight, okay? So this was your fish pose and then we have something called bridge position. So our body looks like a bridge. So I sit down, okay? And then I lie down, I bend my knees. I press my palms down and what I do is, you can watch my hips. So I lift, I press my heels, lift up, lift up, lift up and try to catch your ankle and push it up. And stay there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and slowly down. Inhale and exhale. And next one, we are going to go for something inverted posture. So make sure you have your parents or somebody next to you to help you, guide you. And I'm going to lift it up. Inhale, exhale, and stay. And now this is called shoulder stand, in which your feet are up, your body is up, and your hands are protecting you. And let's go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one, and I'm going to drop, drop, drop slowly. Let's be adventurous and hands up and stay. Five, four, three, two, one, and release, roll down, come up and come back. That was fun. Inhale and exhale. And now let's move to the next animal. The next animal we are doing is cat and cow, okay? So our body looks like cat, cow, camel. We are doing all the animal posture. So we stay like cat. Now, have you seen the cat? So this is how the cat. So we roll, inhale, and come up like a cat. Stretch your body. Round the body like a cow. Inhale. Look up like a cat. Exhale. Inhale. And stay still. Okay? And now I'm just going to stretch my right left leg and stretch my right hand and try to balance. Have you seen a balancing cat? That's what we are doing here. And stay there. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And down. Let's try the other side. And stay. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and down. Inhale and exhale. 
let's try something called camel posture but i'm going to do camel posture with a variation so you come on your knees raise your arms up and we look like a beautiful camel you take your right hand and take it to your left heel and stretch back and stay there eight seven six five four three two one and down and i'm going to switch on other side and stay there eight seven six five four three two one and down and come down into your child pose now this is called child pose because all the child like to children like to stay in this posture and breathe in together exhale five stay in that posture four relax your body three two one and down breathe in breathe out and relax okay and now i'm going to come down and stretch my legs out and stretch your legs out in further classes i'm going to teach you lots of different asanas but today we are just doing some simple postures okay so your legs are nicely open your hands are in the front take clap it nicely and down and drop your elbows down drop your head down and rest and try to take rest think this as your pillow and drop your head onto your pillow and relax five four three two one and relax slowly come up inhale and exhale i'm going to bend this and stretch and go back and go back you can either turn this way pull the legs towards you and stretch and drop your head down 5 4 3 2 1 let's go on other side and switch 5 4 3 2 1 and come back and let's go into something called butterfly Now it looks our body looks like a beautiful wings of the butterfly. You bring the feet and hold them. And I know you feel like moving your feet, but stay nicely. Push your hips down, and I just want you to go down, 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 and drop your hips down, and stay there. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and come back. Now I'm going to do something called cow face. So like it's called Gomukhasana, which is resembles the face of a cow. Okay. So in here, you take the right leg and roll it inside. Then you take the left leg and over it. Okay. And then take your right hand up, nicely stretch up, beautiful long hands, bend back, and take this left hand and try to catch behind, and we look like a cow. So you can see the horns. You can see the legs and sit it and breathe in five sit straight four three two one and relax and now we try to change this side left leg or the right leg change the leg and we this time take this hand up and lock it there and look up five four three two one and relax and now slowly come into sitting sit straight inhale and exhale now we have something padmasana if you guys can sit yes i know you all can sit nicely comfortably so take the right leg place it over the left keep the spine straight hands open and keep it straight maybe you can touch your index finger and your thumb together and create into a mudra mudra is connection with your body nerve endings okay so try to keep the palms like this sit straight and let's take some nice deep inhale exhale inhale exhale and now slowly when i take inhale i raise my head up Look at the sky. Exhale, drop my head down. Shall we do five times? Okay, be with me. So let's start. Inhale. 
exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Let's do one last time. Inhale. Exhale. Try to stay still. You can keep your hands like this or you can keep your hands open. However you feel comfortable, but just try to sit still and try not to move just for a few moments. And stay still. Close your eyes. Keep the face still. Think of something very beautiful. Think of nice, colorful birds, flowers, and sky. Visualize them. You're standing in a beautiful garden with lots of flowers, lots of birds and animals around you and you're playing there. Just stay still and relax. Take a deep inhale and exhale. And try to be calm and peaceful. I'm going to count from 10 to 1 backwards and with each count you're just going to relax. Now you can choose to lie down onto the mat. If you have a cushion, put your head down and cushion and lie down and just try to relax. Open your arms, open your legs and go into Shavasana. This is the lying down portion. And try to relax completely. 10, go more deeper, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Just stay calm and peaceful, eyes closed, body relaxed. Try not to open your eyes. I want you to stay still, not to move your body. And just focus on your breathing. Or think of your favorite color. It could be any color. Think of your favorite animal. And relax. Turn on your left side and come up into sitting. Sit straight. Okay? And now gently bring both the palms together. And nicely rub them, rub them till they're slightly warm. Rub it nicely. Rub, 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 rub. You'll feel nice, warm energy. And now place it over your eyes. Relax your face. Slowly bring it down. Now gently open your eyes, give a beautiful smile, thank you and namaste. So this is Dr. Vaishnavi here with you from Academy of Yoga and I'll see you more classes and I'll teach you lots of postures and the breathing practice in next upcoming classes. Thank you for being with me, see you all, have fun.